Howdy y'all, my name is John Devonport and I'm going to be serving as your executive officer this year. Today we're going to be talking about roaching, which is a really important part of stuff at the green and a part of our game day operations. Um, so uh, for roaching, you're going to need a few things. You're going to need uh, obviously your horse, you're going to need uh, your pair of clippers. Uh, the clippers we keep in the McFerrin building, um, you can find them either underneath the table in the office and the batteries will also be in the office on the charger. So um, first things, uh, before we go into actually roaching, uh, we roach for reasons because it is historically accurate. Um, back in World War I, whenever there was a lot of mustard gas use and a lot of chemical warfare, they had to put gas masks on the horses, obviously. And so um, when they would do that, they had to have a tight seal around the horse's head. And so a mane would have prevented them from being able to do that. So what they did, they roached the horses, they kept them clean shaven. Um, it was part of normal grooming, and so we continue that because we are a World War One style cavalry unit. Um, so, when you're roaching, uh, a couple things. So, this knob here on the clippers is going to control how tight the blades are. It's going to help you out a lot because if blades get loose, they're not going to cut right. Uh, this is going to be your on and off switch right there. Um, and then also, we have oil in the box, uh, which you can see in this black bottle here. And we also have a brush, which is just going to help you keep them nice and clean. Uh, you want to do that before and especially after. And then after we're done, we're going to wash our blades off with blade wash. So, uh, to get started, whenever we roach, you want to make sure the horse knows what you're doing whenever you walk up to him so that he sees the clippers and they know what these mean. Um, and then we're always going to take our horse off of the rail whenever we roach. So, we do that for a couple reasons. First, because it makes it easier on you. Uh, the person roaching the horse, if they're off the rail, that way you can lower their head down. Second, it's also going to keep the horse, if they spook a little bit, from you know going crazy on the rail, which we don't want to happen. Um, not all of these horses are going to be okay uh, with everything you do. Roaching is one of those things because it involves something that's a little scary to them. They do, they're not really sure, um, and especially if you have a new horse or a horse that doesn't know what's going on, then it could be dangerous if you don't have that horse in your hand. So. Um, when we approach the horse, just make sure you go up to the rail. Go ahead and take your horse off the rail. Make sure he sees what's going on here. So he sees I've got the clippers in my hand. See, so he kind of turned away from me. I'm going to bring him back in. And then I'm going to bring his head down. And when I do that, this is one of the hardest parts when it comes to roaching because horses don't always like things that are going in between their eyes. So I'm going to go ahead and show you now. And you see, we get, when we go in, you want to make sure you know where those clippers are going and you see all that hair that you want to get. We're just going to take it off just like that. Make sure it looks nice and clean. You know we want our horses to look good. Just like that. You want to make sure it's good and smooth on top. I'm going to kind of show you another little bit right here. When we go in, you can kind of go in at an angle, that way you can get all that hair. And you just work your way down. And you're going to take the whole mane off down to about where the saddle would go. We leave that for a little extra protection and so that we know exactly where the saddle pad is supposed to go. Let me go ahead and turn these off. So that should be about everything today. Um, thank you all so much for watching the video.